1957. Gottlieb dominated the pinball industry during the 50s and 60s, producing over 200 different tables. Gottlieb was well known for its sport themes, fantasy, casino, and playing card themed tables, like Ace High, during this era. When this game was still an arcade, good players would accumulate replays and sell them back to the arcade owners. This led to banning replays in several states. Just paying attention, man. <laughs> Ace High from 1957. Yay! I think I actually like play, played this one a lot too, um, for on the video game anyway. So I haven't played a whole lot of the uh, old style uh, games, uh, which is unfortunate because most arcade places won't have these old machines. Um, I have to play them in somebody's private uh, collection, pretty much, um, or buy buy one. But uh, these things can be quite uh, expensive to uh, get, and then having to. Uh, restore them because most of them are going to be in poor shape. Uh, I say most of them because some are in private uh, collections that actually take care of them, which is good. And I'm taking care of my uh, high-speed handball machine um, that I'm restoring. Um, that I am excited to uh, work on my first pinball machine uh, to get it working again and uh, make it all shiny again too. Um, that's really something that's uh, got me psyched. Um, considered by many to be the best wide body table of the Terra, and possibly of all time, a true Gobby classic that's very addictive. This table was designed with well thought out objectives and features five flippers. Two flippers in the upper left corner create a mini play field.
to admit that I played this one a lot too because I, I enjoyed the how much there was to it. Uh, are so hot far apart and then you got that those two lanes in the middle. Central Park, 1966. Considered one of the best playing classical tables, Central Park featured a comical back class animation of a monkey ringing a bell at a 100 point score. Pinball Hall of Famers consider mastering table nudging and target shooting on this table to be essential to proving one's expertise at playing classic tables. Thank you. 